Sunday night storm also causing lots of havoc for residents in our area. We've had plenty of flooding videos. Check out this though on the north side. This tree completely sheared off and it crushed this mailbox of this multi resident unit behind me. Public works officials removed the tree from the road and spent much of Monday cutting it up. It's just one of many stops they'll be making all week. Eventually, they'll get here to the 300 block of Wyoming where this tree is blocking the entire street. The back end of my truck was about here. And you can see where it went. Just pretty luckily right around it. You can see Greg Gustafson's gold truck here in this video just feet away. His neighbor across the street wasn't as lucky. That's his white work truck underneath a giant pile of branches. But he wasn't about to let that stop him. So he got out with a chainsaw because he had to go to work. So he spent two hours out there trying to cut his way out. You can see it's pretty brittle. The truck owner's wife, Agnes Thompson, spent most of Monday cleaning up their sidewalk so no one would have to walk under the tree. If you're like Agnes with lots of debris, help is on the way. The city's Solid Waste Division is planning extra curbside pickups starting Saturday. In Billings, Casey Conlon, MTN News.